see so far for this tournament. Thorbjorn Gunnarsson has six goals and five assists for 11 points through four games. Pretty good. Let's see, we have some. We have a trade point here we can buy. Um, do we want to go marksman? Slapshot accuracy. Now let's go right here. Now you have marksman level two right there. That's good. And I recently had an interview uh, with my agent, and he said that I'm currently predicted to go first overall in the draft. Um, if they're wearing white, let's wear the black Winterhawks jerseys. Those are those always look really nice in my opinion. The, the all blacked out ones. So yeah, I think I'm just going to. Um, know not play every game all that stuff I'm the, the first video in this series actually got pretty good feedback it was really nice to see got a good amount of views on it like nearly 200 views right now I think so uh, that's definitely encouraging and made me want to hop in here and um, do a second one for sure in the final and then I'll probably uh, I'll probably um, go up and get drafted and see what team I end up in and then I'll end the video there but opening face off of the Memorial Cup final let's see okay Ottawa wins the buck but we get possession back in our zone and now we're out here running with it oh wide open up here oh so close I thought that might have gone in between his pads there but he closed them up too quickly Man, I was wide open there. I should have I should have definitely buried that. Probably should have uh, done a bit more of a move there or something, but oh, okay, let's go up here. Oh, he's over there. Man, okay, that was, a, that was a bad pass once it once it was that went across the blue line, but before that, I'm just trying to get the offense going out here. Oh, he was wide open in the slot dude. That was that was ugly stuff. It's right here. Hit me up here. Good, good. Wide open. There we go. The first minute of the final, and I get an assist on the go ahead goal. Seth Jarvis, his third goal of the tournament. Seth Jarvis, who in real life is actually having a pretty good um, rookie season so far. He's uh, in. Carolina, and I think he had a, I think he had two points in his NHL debut. So that was pretty cool to see. Uh, you know, form as a Winterhawks fan, seeing former Winterhawks in the NHL. Uh, Joel Hofer, also who's actually the goalie in this game for the Winterhawks. Um, Joel Hofer uh, played for uh, St. Louis. Uh, just a couple days ago, and I think in his NHL debut he got the win. I want to say that he got the shutout as well, but I'm not 100% confident in that. It might have just been a regular win, but still, a win on your NHL debut, that's pretty good. Um, Hofer's a guy that I really hope uh, has a good career in the NHL, you know, even though Whatever, he's not with any of my teams. Uh, he's, just, he's such an awesome guy, and I loved his time in Portland. Um, Portland traded for him, I don't know, like 2018, 2019, something like that. Uh, he wasn't originally theirs, but then he finished off his junior's career uh, in Portland after being traded for, and he was just he was an incredible, great goalie. One of the best goalies I've watched in my time as a Winterhawks fan, that's for sure. Alright, I uh, couldn't really get anything going on that uh, shift, unfortunately. Not a whole lot of offense there, but um, especially on the power play, that was bad. Uh, I don't even think we got like, a good, decent uh, shot on goal through that power play, unfortunately. Okay. Oh, over here. Ah, I just went a little bit high there. I was trying to pick the, the, the top right corner there, but it ended up sailing a little high. Um, that's alright, my accuracy is only going to get better. It's at an 84 right now. Ooh, but I drew another penalty. 
that's good though. Um, back to back, drawing penalties, and we get three seconds of a five on three, so maybe time for one shot, but nope, they win the face off, but we do have another power play coming immediately uh, following the end of our first power play. So their PK units don't get any time to rest, they have to keep icing a four man unit, so that's huge. Now we seem to go in there and win that buck. Unfortunately, they did not win the buck. And it sails out of play. My power play unit's going to the bench, but hopefully McKee are going back out with like a minute and uh, about a minute remaining on the power play. Going to try to extend this lead. They go offside, so big face off coming up right here. The Ottawa 67s. I'm assuming that's because they were formed in 1967. That's that's what I, you know, that's what I assume. Maybe 1867, but that seems perhaps a little too old for a junior hockey team. I don't know. Oh, that should have been in right there. If you had just maintained control of that puck a little bit better, I think you could have uh, backhanded that into the net there. But it definitely is a tricky. Jesus, man, my stick was all over that puck, but 
I just couldn't get it for some reason. I, got, I had some success with the tie up on these back to backs. So I was going to try that again, but. sometimes allows themselves to get into board battles like instead of just taking it off with the puck they'll like let themselves oh, try to snipe there but that was wildly off target like aggressively inaccurate there we go there we go it was that does that do a bureau is that who that was but he restores the one goal advantage Jaden duro restores the one goal advantage. Is it still the first period? Jesus, it's still the first half of the first period. Or it's, it, it's only been half of the period, rather. Boom. I had to light that guy up one time. You know how it is. Even though I'm going to give up a, a pretty decent scoring chance there by not playing the puck, but I just wanted to light that guy up. I, uh, just looking at me funny. Up here. Nice. Nice. Oh. Oh, that should have been a goal. He got that rebound right there. Dang, I was wide open there with the, the yawning cage on that left hand side. Just they couldn't get it to me. Here we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Ugh. I was trying to cut through the defense there, pull like a uh, bullet Connor McDavid on him, just boop, 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 in and out, in and out, but <clears throat> couldn't get it going. Um, I am going to be putting up a ton of hockey-related content in probably this week, so get ready for that. Like, I have a bunch of... Um, like, I, I don't know, just for the last couple of days, I have a bunch of ideas that are, like, hockey-related that I could do videos about. Um, I want to do a video talking about, like, the biggest surprises and disappointments of the NHL season so far. I thought that'd be an interesting video. And I wanted to do a video, um, where I, like, went in and designed the jerseys for a hypothetical Portland NHL expansion team. I thought that could be a pretty interesting video to do because I have this template that allows you to like go in and create your own jersey that I assume it's used for like people who create beer league jerseys and things like that to send off to have them made but I was going to use that to make a jersey like I said for a fictional Portland NHL team but unfortunately Ottawa gets the rebound put away and they tie the game at two uh, with just a few minutes left here in the first period yeah about four minutes left in the first so this is a pretty uh, um, what are you doing? What is this guy doing? I mean, that's exactly what I'm talking about, dude. Like, the AI in this game, he won the puck, and then he skated all the way back to the boards. Dude, pass me the puck, what are you doing? He skated all the way back to the boards, and then just, like, allowed himself to get into a puck, puck battle for absolutely no reason. Doesn't make any sense, like, tactically or strategically. in this game does weird things. Okay, get the button. Okay, there you go. Okay, we're on the power play, nice. I'm not sure how we're on the power play, but we are. Also, is it just me, or does this period feel like exceptionally long compared to how long these periods usually are? What the hell was that over?
assist to get the secondary assist on that. Uh, two, two minutes after they tie the game, Reese Newkirk restores the advantage for Portland. And I get the assist, so I think this game I now have uh, two, I think I have a goal and assist. That's what I think. Goal and assist. Alright. This is uh, five goals in one period here between these two teams. Uh, not a very um, deep at the final. Player that I have a 
signed book of sitting in my closet. Um, but yeah, you know, I have the shot, but I just need to get my speed there, and uh, I'll be able to play those angles and everything a little bit better, you know, get behind the defense and stuff, because uh, right now, if I'm on the break, you know, the skaters behind me catch up to me before I can get a clean shot on goal, just because my speed isn't that good. There we go. Good, good. I need to light this guy up. Oh, did I get a boarding penalty? Oh well, I just have to light somebody else up. Okay, and, and they, what I get? Is that a board or a charge? Okay, I get a charge there. Um, I don't really see how that was a charge in some of the other hits that I played this game haven't been, but uh, whatever I suppose. We, we don't give up a goal on that penalty kill, so I'm not gonna be too upset about it. Yeah, like that, like, the, the guy's just way faster than me, and I'm not sure. I, I probably just need to put points into my, into my skating ability. Um, and my skill tree, I need to put in some points into skating. That should help me a decent bit. Alright, let's see. Okay, we won the puck there, so I don't need to cover that guy anymore. I wish. 
wish that oh, Eddie goes into a board battle for some reason. Dude, what is happening? Lay that guy out. Oh, this guy has it coming. Like that. I, I totally laid the body into that guy also. He didn't even... I almost, I, I was going to risk it all. I was going for a big interference right there. Hit me up here. Bruh, what are you doing? Why are you all the way back in our zone, dude? The AI is very weird in this game. Like, they win the puck and instead of advancing, just skate all the way back into our own zone. I don't. Doesn't make sense to me. Does not make sense to me. strong 
it's things like that that make me question whether the AI is cheating, like when your own team just, like, does weird things on the play, because you noticed, like, that whole time. Also, like, the rest of our players were nowhere to be found, and then this guy not giving me the puck until it's no longer advantageous to the play. That was, like, I could have had a wide open break there, he just didn't want to give it to me. Bizarre. Bizarre, bizarre, bizarre. Ooh. Oh, this guy's getting it. How is, how is that interference, dude? Oh, that was an interference because I hit him like just a few seconds after he released the puck. But all right, uh, it remains six on four, which is good. We have about just under 15 minutes to go. I think my teammates hate me because 
is. Ooh, and then I get the puck.
this guy's probably going into the boards. Alright. 15.8 seconds remaining. See if we can uh, perhaps go down and grab another uh, another one on their end, but doubtful. Okay. And that guy just completely uh, avoided me, and then that guy just goes into the boards again. Uh, but there we go. The Portland Winter Hawks win the Memorial Cup. champions, there we are, uh, the Ottawa 67s are in complete and total disarray, they don't know what to do with themselves, um, yeah, just a lot of, a lot of bad, bad vibes on that side of the ice over there, I'm personally very glad that I'm not on that side of the ice at the moment. Everything as we're just over here jumping up and down. Like, <laughs> there we go. Now here's the handshake line. Congratulating them. Like, yep, you suck. You suck. You suck. You're a bitch. Hate you. Can't wait to see you not get drafted. Just absolute gong show out there. Just tearing dudes apart and giving them a what for. These guys all hate each other. They have bad intentions. Each and every one of them. But here we come, coming up here to lift the trophy. There's our captain. And there's the Moral Cup trophy. Whoop. He's going to parade around the ice with it. Uh, pass it off to me, of course, because I'm the best player on the team easily. But I'm, I'm just going to skip the celebration. This is going to go on forever. I do not want to go to the LA Kings. So let's see. Don't really 
ask you a question today, better right to begin. Alright. Your teammates invite you out, but you may not make her view if you go. Do you go with them? Without a doubt, who am I to say no? What is your favorite feeling when playing hockey? It's fun and it's great exercise. Just like